Assalamualaikum and a very good day to everybody. Today I'm going to speak about a systematic literature review on neuroscience of conceptual learning in mathematics. My name is Wan Nurliza Wambaka. I am from UITM campus Kelantan in the Faculty of Computer and Mathematical Science. What is conceptual learning? Conceptual learning in mathematics is defined as a tactical reasons why operation regarding numerical values work as they do. And the neuroscience of conceptual learning in mathematics explained about brain activation occurs while studying mathematics. So it is very important to search for the relationship between neuroscience and conceptual learning in order to prepare an effective instructional methodology for students. For this research, the methodology is a systematic literature study have been done to analyze past studies related to neuroscience of conceptual learning in mathematics. Those literature studies were taken from Google Scholar, Eric, Science Direct, and Springer, and have been used to get information on those relationships. Below are numbers of literature studies taken from Google Scholar 7, from Eric 7, from Science Direct 6, Springer 6, and the total are 26. And the data analysis. From the survey, it can be found that the researcher is interested on exploring about deep conceptual learning. Deep conceptual learners generally tend to think, discuss, and query in search of the meaning of the concept. So, the concept of deep conceptual learning is a maximum widespread for expertise coaching and gaining knowledge in better education. Due to Tony, 2014, deep conceptual learners are able to make connections among disciplines with those understanding in mind, it will be feasible to help disinterested junior college students to look for attachments in principle and practice as a lesson in life. This new process and understanding would require instructor to develop new method of teaching. And later on, many researchers, mainly in technology and arithmetic education, have highlighted the use of software of neuroscience or cognitive technology into arithmetic. Anderson Contour 2013, Pankhurst Rivet 2013. In those procedures, multimedia together with text, graphic, video, animation, and simulation are typically designed as a manner of improving study motivation. This consists of virtual learning environments and different interactive media, together with web-based learning, cellular and computer-supported collaborative game. Neuroscience then had been lately connected to instruction generation field where the iMotion method has been carried out, and some researchers have used iMotion information to recognize among cognitive techniques and research outcomes. Later on, modern research technologies have substantially improved the knowledge of brain structure at increasingly finer stages of resolution. They provide technology educators and a few neurosciences subsidize statistics as a basis to increase consequences oriented curricular and coaching techniques. So the next stage of research is focusing on inhibiting earlier ideas to encourage understanding on the concept.
Researcher is heading on conceptual understanding, which is the position of large networks of many elements in mind. Researchers found that overlapping part of neural structure is for processing concrete and summary principle, a model representation that go beyond unique modalities and understanding is a precise of motor structures. Researchers found that in studying new principles, one should conquer earlier ideas, which then will be correctly assimilated. So it is the need for youngsters to inhibit precurrent ideas for better understanding. In conclusion, what is the meaning of conceptual learning? Conceptual learning comes from the ability of inhibition and focus. Neuro imaging report found that the process of logical and reasoning is related to the activation of different elements in the brain. They are the activation of ACC that is anterior cingulate cortex, prefrontal cortex, the inferior frontal cortex and dorsolateral prefrontal cortex or DLPFC. And the ability to control focus and inhibition then will improve the reasoning capabilities. So with that, I thank you.